Hi, beautiful souls. Welcome to my channel. My name is Kimiana. This is the Intuitive Soul Tribe. Here we talk about all things manifesting, so law of attraction, law of assumption, and mental health. So if those are your vibes, hit the like below and the sub so you don't miss any of my videos. Let's get into this, guys. So we are going to start talking about how to get your specific person, any specific person, even if this person doesn't even know you exist, to miss you intensely. And I mean quick, okay? This is going to work and this technique is very powerful. So please make sure you watch till the end so you don't miss out on any gems. Let's get into this, guys. So when it comes to making anyone miss you, the first step is to always, 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 always remember that you are the one that creates your reality. Not them, not your mama, not bend down the street. You, okay? So what that means is everything's you is pushed out. Everything is you pushed out. Everything is you pushed out. So if it takes reminding yourself of that, even just for a little bit every day, that is going to do major, major moves for you because you are constantly, consistently rewiring your brain. Remember when you watch videos about revision and stuff, this is kind of the same concept. What you're doing is you are telling your brain a different story that it's used to. So the story it's used to is, man, life is happening to me. What are you talking about? I don't create nothing. That used to be the old story. Now the new story is uh, I create everything. And if there's something in my universe, something in my circle that I don't like, I can change it period. You could change it. Okay. So with that being said, whether you're dealing with someone, you know, whether you're dealing with someone who doesn't know you exist, you can get them to miss you. Okay. I know you're probably thinking like, how can I get someone to miss me that doesn't know I exist? The first thing is you need to get that person in your mind, visualize this person in your mind, needing you for something. So sometimes people are manifesting people that they are probably far away from, like at a long distance and maybe that person doesn't know you exist well you know they exist based off some connection whatever that connection is whether it's work you know people work remotely these days so that could be the case too or uh you went to school with this person or whatever connect with that that you and this person have a connection you guys know of each other's existence and now you guys are communicating and they are communicating that they miss you that they haven't seen you in a while they've like saw a glimpse of you but they weren't really aware of who you are but they did want to talk to you but they just didn't know what to say you're going to do this in letter form so if it's easier for you to text it like they're sending you a text message like omg you went to school with me you're so beautiful though i never knew like we had class together and da 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 you can like you can put yourself in the person's shoes that is missing you and you can then create an existence where they now know you and they're reaching out to you all right and that's how you do it you do it in a letter form or a text form like they are texting you like omg you are gorgeous i never knew that you you know watch my content or this or that you know you catch my drift okay so that's for my people who is someone we don't know right for the people who are manifesting someone you do know what you want to do when you want them to miss you is you have to feel exactly what it feels like to miss them this is the tricky part right when you miss somebody what is happening when you're missing them you're thinking of like their presence and all the amazing conversations and the giddiness and the happiness and the laughing and the love and the calls and the facetimes and all that right you're thinking about all that now i want you to envision your specific person feeling those same exact things that giddiness that smile you like, that that urgency, that just sense of urgency that I just need to talk to you, I need to talk to you, I need to talk to you, I miss you so much, I miss you so much, oh my gosh, can I call you, can I call you, can I call you? Get in the state, close your eyes if you have to, get into that feeling of your specific person feeling those same emotions you feel for them, they feel that for you right now, right now. They are like, oh my God, I wonder what she's doing. I can't get her off my mind. I can't get him off of my mind. What do I do? I really want to reach out to her. I hope that she won't reject me. Oh my God, I miss her. I miss her. I miss her. She's just so beautiful inside and out. I haven't talked to her. I wonder what she's doing. Is she okay? I love her. OMG, OMG. Now open your eyes. I want you to practice that visualization, that, that few second visualization as much as you can throughout the day. What that does is you transfer your emotions that you feel, the love and compassion you feel towards them, the giddiness, the excitedness, the happy feelings that you feel towards this person. What you're doing is you're giving it to them and you're giving them that power that they now hold, which is the confidence to reach out to you and be like, I miss you. I cannot get enough of you. Oh my God, what are you doing? How's life been? Blah, 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 right? Because the the idea is that you want this person to miss you because you miss them. That's kind of like 
a one in one. So with that being said, give them transfer over that same energy, that same love, that same compassion, that same joy, that same everything and envision what it looks like on them to feel the same exact way with you. And you can play around with this. This is a very small scene. So it's, it's easier to replay small scenes because you're not doing the most. You're not adding all these, you know, details that may be hard to remember. So when you transfer these feelings and these emotions to your SP, what you can do in these scenes is you can maybe envision them holding their phone, looking at your social media, scrolling through your Instagram, wondering what you're doing, looking at old pictures of you guys together. You can envision what that looks like while you're transferring this energy to them because now you're them. So them will be looking down, smiling like, oh my God, I miss her. What is she doing? I want to talk to her. I wonder if she's busy. I wonder if he's busy. Like, no, uh, well, yeah, I think I should call her. I think I should call him. You can do these things as them. And then what you do is you really go live your life. After you're done doing this, you can do this as many times as you want. You could do it in your head. You don't have to physically hold the phone. If it's better for you, if it works for you that way, do it that way. But for me, I just replay that scene over and over and over again throughout the day and I'm like, good to go. And the next thing you know, you're getting a text and they're texting you. And so one of the key things that I do with this technique is I make sure I'm peaceful and relaxed when I do it because it's very important if you're stressed out and you got all this stuff going on you're not gonna be able to focus on the scene so like make sure it's times where you're peaceful maybe you're shopping maybe you're walking around you can do it around those times as well when you're busy um but just if it's like chaotic if there's a lot going on that's probably not the best scenario but if you know you're in a calm setting even if it's just going to home depot it really doesn't matter you can replay this scene and i guarantee you if they didn't text you they're going to text you back if they didn't miss you yesterday, they definitely miss you today. And another thing that is really powerful, I, I've been wondering how to tell you guys this because it's a technique I've formed on my own. It wasn't something I learned from someone else. But for my technique, I'm very, I, I always say to all my recurring viewers that we're all connected, okay? So if your SP already knows you and you guys already have ha had a connection, all you have to do is think of them thinking of you right now right now and and you do it in a way as if you're that person you're not going to do it as if like you're creating it because we already know you're creating it but it's like a wire you know how they say there's un like uh invisible wires we're connected to people and you got to cut the wire yeah that's what i mean cut the cord my bad i'm using the word wire ah! Anyway, so that cord is connected to them. And so when you're thinking, just like if you thought about your mom, right? Like, what is she doing right now? And then like, next thing you know, she's calling you, same concept. So you're thinking of them. It doesn't matter. You don't have to think about where they're at or what they're doing. You're just thinking of them. And they are thinking of you right now. And all you got to say in your head is, you're thinking about me right now. And if you don't want to say anything because that's screwing up your visualization, just feel it and know it's happening and feel it like you will feel it because you guys are connected. You will feel them thinking about you. I know, right? Cool. I, I was just doing it. It's so cool. Anywho, when you get your text, when you get your call, let me know in the comment section below, or you could just tell me how you like the video in the comment section and what you want to see next. Guys, if you made it this far and you're a new viewer, oh my God, welcome to the Intuitive Soul Tribe. You are now an Intuitive Soul Gym. So welcome. Hit the sub if you haven't already and like the video. Guys, if you haven't, get the Manifest Everything journal. You are going to love it, okay? If you're wondering, what is this journal and what does it do for me? It will help you manifest your SP extremely fast. It has very powerful affirmations in there and I have very very powerful techniques so you will love 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 this journal if you already have one get another one I don't know what you're doing because this journal is going to change your life that's why it's called manifest everything journal all right I do offer coaching so if you guys need any one-on-one -on -one sessions I got you I do have 30 minute sessions and I have one hour sessions if you need more than one session I do have packages for that you could check that in the link description below and when you have your first session with me we'll schedule the next it's that simple okay so you guys can choose your package I do do email coaching. So if you need help manifesting and you want a video on advice, I can send that through email along with the affirmations. 
that will be custom to your situation okay so that's below as well guys i'm sending you guys lots of love and light if you haven't already i'm going to tell you right now straight out the gate that you're missing out if you have not joined the vip soul jimmy lights group you are missing out in that membership group i put all my coaching material okay so if you've do if you're doing one-on-one sessions with me of course you're going to get more added on detailed information based off your custom situation but in this coaching group this is where we share affirmations we have lives that are specific to what you guys need help with member only videos as i said before and you get first time access to all my videos that i upload so every video that is to the public you get access to it first it is a win-win for you plus affirmations that are very powerful so i don't know what you're doing but go click that join link you will not regret it and you will love it in our community here's where we share love and compassion and where you guys remember your power where you remember who you are you can manifest anything you want you just gotta believe it okay i'm sending you guys lots of love lots of light and as i always say go get your boo bye y'all Couldn't one in a dozen The other eleven